I had a knock on the back door one day and you know, it's a young guy and, and his uncle and coming by to try and sell us craft brewers some hops. And that's really where that relationship started with Blake and uh, Brian Crosby. And uh, the, the product that they had was great. It was substantially better than what we were using. Uh, and that relationship is something that I've managed to maintain uh, over the course of two employers and eight or nine years at this point. There's always something new and exciting happening at Sun River uh, Brewing Company. We had uh, an exceptional weekend at Great American Beer Festival this year. Being able to win a gold medal with Fuzztail Hefeweizen, one of our core beers, uh, you know, and, and following that up with a, a gold medal for uh, Cinder Beast Imperial Red. And then, you know, the, 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 the big award, uh, Small Brewery of the Year and uh, Brewer of the Year for Small Brewery. It validates what we do in here. Hop quality is exceptionally important for us uh, as we do tend to focus on a lot of hop forward beer styles. Oregon grown and Crosby grown in particular certainly have a, a substantially different character than the equivalent hop grown in the Yakima Valley or over in uh, McCall, Idaho, or you know maybe even in the Southern Hemisphere. Definitely uh, these Crosby grown varieties, floral, uh, juicy, just really, really wonderful stuff to work with. Being able to go walk the fields at Crosby, knowing the people that grow them and harvest them, you, 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 you'll see minor changes from year to year based on growing conditions, but those are one of the things that, that build so much consistency in our beer is uh, essentially a single source for hops. Crosby Hop Farm will, will definitely be part of our future growth. I think we're going to be part of Crosby Hop Farm's growth as well. Uh, and I look forward to many years uh, of doing business with Crosby Hop Farm.